we will start we will start with the scripture and i'll probably thank tanya throughout the day because she is uh, great for unto us is born to us a son is given and the government will be on his shoulders and he will be called wonderful counselor mighty god everlasting father prince of peace and now we'll have the prayer by christopher phil fletcher if we can all bow our heads and close our eyes. Dear gracious Lord, we come to you today with an open mind and an open heart, not asking for nothing but understanding and thanking you for dying on the cross for our sins, for giving us life, eternal life, life on earth for us to prove to you that we're worthy to be with you, life on heaven. Please, Lord, touch our minds and our hearts, people with the less needy people dealing with anxiety, depression, anything that's shortcoming of what your will is, please be with us all. And as you know, we are born sinners, but we won't die sinners because we believe in our Lord and our Savior, Jesus Christ. This is your time, as always your time. We're here to fulfill your will at all times. Please forgive us for the sins and our shortcomings. And we're so thankful and we embrace you, Lord, and we call upon your name for anything, good, bad, ugly, sad, everything comes through you through the will of the Lord, our Lord and our God. Please bless us all. I hope we can please you with this program. In our wonderful name we pray, amen. 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 And now we'll have Emily. We'll do our occasion and our welcome. And then we'll start the program. We don't have a written program. We're just going to flow with it. Thank you. All right. Welcome, everybody. Uh, Dr. Zacharias, ministerial staff, visitors, and my John Wesley family. Good morning. Good morning. Welcome to the Performing Arts Ministry, Sunday School, and Women's Home and Overseas Missionary Society Angel Tree Christmas Program. We thank you all for coming to be with us this morning virtually. Ring my bell, Mari. We have an opportunity to demonstrate that no man is a failure if he has friends. John Wesley has been a participant with the Salvation Army Angel Tree Program. And over the past 25 years, countless churches have partnered with the Angel Tree to bring light into the lives of children of the incarcerated and welcome them into the community of believers. John Wesley is among these churches. Now the bell, ring it again, Kamari. It reminds us, okay, <laughs> that one of our favorite movies, It's a Wonderful Life, <clears throat> a story where an angel is sent from heaven to help a desperately frustrated <clears throat> businessman, George Bailey, played by Jimmy Stewart. You remember that movie? It's about a divine intervention by an angel who's a guardian angel to help a man in distress. You see, the angel in heaven has been receiving prayers from mortals like, please God, something's the matter with Daniel. After the angel in heaven hears the desperate prayers, they send an angel to the earth to help George. They select Clarence, a somewhat down in his luck angel who hasn't yet earned his wings. The senior angel promised that Clarence will get his wings if he succeeds. Rush to the end, Clarence the angel succeeds in the last scene as the whole crowd sings Hark the Herald, angels sing, and then Lord, uh, O Lang Syne. George finds a book under the Christmas tree with a brief handwritten note that reads, Dear George, remember, no man is a failure if he has friends. Thanks for the wings. Love, Clarence. When asked who Clarence is, George just says, it's a Christmas present from a very dear friend. At that moment, a bell on the Christmas tree rings. George's daughter, Zuzu says, look daddy, teacher says, every time a bell rings, an angel gets his wings. Now, by supporting with 
the Angel Tree Program of Prison Ministry, we demonstrate our commitment to ministering to children and bring joy and love to others this Christmas and maybe even help an angel get his wings. I was always taught that it is more blessed to give than to receive. Thank you for your donations to this ministry, whether it be financial or your time or your talents. Again, thank you, thank you, thank you. Now, let's begin our program. Thank you. Isaiah 9, 7 says, of the increase of his government and peace there will be no end. He will reign on David's throne and over his kingdom establishing and upholding it with justice and righteousness from the time on and forever. The zeal of the Lord Almighty will accomplish this. The words of the Old Testament prophet Isaiah quoted here before you rings down through the years of over 2,000 years ago to us today. Who do they describe? Of whom do they speak? They tell the Messiah. They tell us of the Messiah, the promised one, the Christ, who was the savior of mankind. Plus the night before Christmas. It was the night before Christmas, a long time ago. The hillside was peaceful, the moon was aglow. The world couldn't know from what happened before that men would remember this night evermore. The sheep on the hillside, their days journeyed over, were dreaming sweet dreams of a field full of clover. The shepherds were watchful while guarding their flock. The earth was a pillow the stars were their clock. Then all of a sudden they jumped at the sight of the skies all ablaze with a heavenly light. They huddled in fear, then they started to rise as the lightning light flashed or opened the skies. The heavens were split by the silvery ray. The dark disappeared and the night became day. And lo, at the end of the rainbow of light appeared then an angel to banish their fright. The angel brought news of a birth in a manger and bade them to hasten to welcome the stranger for a Mary had just given birth to a boy whose coming would bring so much comfort and joy. A choir of angels looked down from the sky, and heavenly voices were heard from on high. Peace be on earth, and goodwill to all men. The Savior has come on this night. Amen. The heavenly angels then faded from sight. The sky once again turned from day to night. The shepherds all quickly rose from the ground and hurried to go where the child would be found. As they reached Bethlehem, the inn was in sight. It led like a path to a soft little bed and shone very tenderly on a child's head. The child in the manger was sleeping so sound. His eyes were still closed as the shepherds stood around. Thousands of years would be warmed by the glow Guided by light from a bright shining star, came a pilgrimage led of three kings from afar. They were dressed in the finest of satins and lace. Their complexions were that of an orient race. The three wealthy kings were wise men and proud, but they went to Christ's child and solemnly bowed. They came bearing treasures of incense and gold to that sweet little child, still not very old. The star in the sky twinkled down from above. The world was awakened to kindness and love. The past was forgotten, the future was bright, and the spirit of Christmas was born on that night. Amen. And that was the night before Christmas. Thank you.
Thank you, everyone. Who was that was great. Thank you. That was nice. Now, let's get to some fun. Excellent. Um, we are going to play, do, not play, but the play of Pass the Mic. And first, we're going to go to the house of Michael and Mark Carter, and we're going to hear them play some instruments. Let's see their video. Hello, my name is Michael Carter. Today I will, be I will be playing two songs, Michael Rode the Boat Ashore and Carnival. singing Santa Claus is coming to town. <laughs> Ooh. Everyone ready, prepared to hear the song? We are ready for you. Okay. So I may have forgotten some of the words, but I'm gonna try my best. Everybody bear with me. So Santa Claus is coming to town. Santa Claus is coming to town. You better watch out. You better not cry. You better watch, huh? I'm telling you why. Santa Claus is coming to town. Santa Claus is coming to town. That's all I remember. So we'll go with that. Great. Woo Thank you, Solomon. The last <laughs> one is Santa Claus is coming to, to town. There it is. Okay. Now we have an original by Christopher Fletcher and Kamari Fletcher. What do y'all have for us today? We're excited. You know what's approaching. It's that time of year to get ready 
for the launch, laughter, happiness, and cheers. Making trips to jam-packed malls and shopping online. Don't worry, my last-minute shoppers will now have Amazon Prime. We love giving and receiving gifts, yet it's still not the reason why we all should take time to acknowledge, acknowledge this Christmas season. We're, We're all here to spread the word, and this is no secret, to remember to give praise and thanks to our Lord and Savior Jesus. For it is his birthday, and we should celebrate. He literally died on the cross for our sins, for heaven's sake, for the sake of mankind, and for the sake of others. Let us all rejoice in his name, my sisters and brothers. We don't mean to preach, but only to share the message of Jesus Christ and how he is here. Happy birthday, birthday Jesus, Jesus, and Merry, Merry Christmas. Christmas. Peace! <laughs> Thank you. We will now have Emily sing, Oh, come all ye faithful. Oh, come all ye faithful. Joyful and triumphant, oh come ye, oh come ye to Bethlehem. Come and behold him, born the king of angels. Oh, come, let us adore. Oh, come, let us adore him. Oh, come, let us adore him. Christ the Lord. And that was wonderful. Thank you, Emily. We are having a good time, Stephanie and I are going to visit some homes. Now we're going to go to the home of Margaret Dorsey Jones. Hi, Margaret. Hello. Hello, everybody, Hello. and welcome. We're so happy you're here. Virgil was supposed to be here. He's a little bit under the weather, so we're going to excuse him. But it's so much fun being here and having a great time. And thank you, Stephanie and Rhonda for just coming over. So one of my favorite uh, songs for Christmas is Wild By My Sheep. So I'll just sing a verse. Wild by my sheep, I watched at night, glad tidings brought an angel bright. How great our joy, great our joy, 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 joy. Praise we to God in heaven on high. Praise we to God in heaven on high. Praise we to God in heaven on high. Thanks. And I can go to the next house. So thanks for coming by. Thanks Thank for having us. Everyone. We're now going over to Roz Jenkins' house. Roz, you ready for us to sing? You're going to sing Angels We Have Heard on High. Yes, but I'm so happy to be here and hear all of the wonderful songs and the programs. It's just been such a delight. Thank you for coming to my home. Do you like my beautiful Christmas tree? Thank you for having us. Oh, of course. Do you like the tree? Is it we love it. We love it. Too? I love it too. Too bad it's not really here, but anyway. <laughs> yes, and I will be singing one of my favorite songs, Angels We Have Heard on High. Angels we have heard on high, sweetly singing o'er the plains and the mountains in reply. Echoing their joyous strains, Gloria in excelsis Deo, Gloria in excelsis Deo. 
feel. Thank you so much for coming by. Thank you. And I like this little journey we on, we're on. I'm waiting for the next house. Thank you all and Merry, Merry Christmas. Thank you. Merry Christmas to you too. Well, why don't we take a trip to Cecilia Davis' house? I think she has something special for us today. Cecilia. Hello, everybody. Hello. It is. Hey, Cecilia. Hi, everybody. It is so good to see everyone here today in their hats and their poems. And it's just a joyous occasion. And I would like, thank you, first of all, for coming to my house. You can come again if you'd like. Um, my house is always open to all of you. But today, I will sing in my house, Joy to the World. This is a joyous occasion. And for the second verse, I would like everyone to join in and sing the second verse. He rules the world. And um, here we go. Joy to the world, the Lord is come. Let earth receive her king. Let every heart prepare him room. And heaven and nature sing. And heaven and nature sing. And heaven, heaven and nature sing. Now everyone join in. He rules the world with truth and grace and makes the nations prove the glories of his righteousness and wonders of his love and wonders of his love and wonders and wonders and of his love thank you for stopping by my house and this has been a wonderful wonderful program it has thank you thank you everyone now I'm going to put somebody on the spot before we end and see if anybody wants to sing for well, Stephanie and I, we can get by there real quick. You can whisper in our ear, we'll hear it in the atmosphere. If somebody wants to sing a Christmas carol, anybody want to take a stab at that? Anybody want to pass, we can pass the mic to? Because we can get to you fast. <laughs> I guess the only way I would sing if everybody would join me. But if it's singing Silent Night. I don't see, I see those little, what is it, mute signs on. So that means that you are not going to sing with me. But yeah, I hope you will. I need your help. Okay. I can't hear any of you. We're singing silently. Oh. <laughs> Silent night. Holy night. All is calm, all is bright. Round young virgin, mother and child, holy in tender and mild, sleep in heavenly Sleep in heavenly peace. I'm clapping for myself because I knew the words. <laughs> Thank you, Mama. That was great. I don't know about the, I don't know about the second verse though. <laughs> Thank that you. This is very nice. Because she wasn't on mute, so she was singing with you. So you can thank her for adding to that too. <laughs> thank you. Well, thank you, everyone. This was a wonderful program. Look at God and what he can do. Um, it is amazing how when people who love God, whose spirit is for God, who works toward everything toward God, 
can put something together that is so great and so wonderful and full of laughter, joy, and peace. And I'm gonna thank God for this program. I wanna thank Tanya for everything that she does each and every time she works with us and Renee for sending out the information. I'd like to thank Elena Jenkins, those who were in the video, Michael and Mark Carter who were at Track Beats and that's why they couldn't be live because they're running track and Mark is doing his shot put so we can say yay to them. Bahawa and Michael Carter who helps us do the videos, Wayne and Wyatt and Reverend Rima Murdo, Matthew and Jennifer Roseboro, Christina Lindo, Patience Hudson, Hudson, Emily Kamari Chris, the Performing Arts, Solomon, Cecilia, Margaret, Virgil in his absence because he was going to do it. We talked earlier this week. Rosalind, Emily, Chris, and Kamari for their original poem. And then just all of you, the Performing Arts and Angel Tree Committee, of course, our pastor and first lady, and everybody who supports. Before I turn it over to Emily or the pastor, I'd like to leave us with this scripture. The King, Matthews 40, 45. Matthews 25, 40. Yo, the king will reply, truly I tell you, whatever you did for one of the least of these, of these brothers and sisters, you did for me. So that is a model of angel truth. When we work for the homeless, when we work for the glory of God, whatever we do for somebody, we do it for Jesus as long as we're doing it from our heart. And like Dr. Carter said, every chamber of our heart. Thank you, everyone. Stephanie, you wanna go come make some comments? Thank you everybody for always supporting us. We love you and thank you for inviting us into your homes. Have a Merry Christmas. Same to you. Uh, can we recognize our president from the homes, Ms. Petaway? Do you have anything to say? No, different people's houses. Oh. Ms. Petaway, you on mute. All right. No, I don't have anything different to say, just to thank each person who is on the line and all those who participated. It's just wonderful to see the growth of the children too. I didn't know that Mark and his brother play instruments and that was great. And Kamari is just growing. I can see it in his, uh, in his response and in his physical character, he is really growing. It's just, just so wonderful. And I thank each of you for, for being on the line this morning. And I see Dr. J is on, um, Dr. Julia Marshall is on the line. It's wonderful to have her join us this morning. And I see that Eleanor Wilder is with us. So thank you for joining us at all. And I wanted to say to Tanya that thank you for your um, cooperation and for getting the program on this morning. We couldn't have done it without you. Rosalind and everybody, thank you so very much. Barbara, your song was wonderful. I enjoyed hearing you sing. Thank you. <laughs> and Merry Christmas to Merry everyone. Christmas to you. <laughs> thank you so much. So that's it. Have a great day. You too. Rhonda, you're on book. I was going to be the one that did that. I told y'all to. <laughs> I'm not sure if the pastor or first lady's on or any of the ministers. So if you would end us, in the, Emily, um, with prayer, you or Stephanie, um, we can end the program or anyone can pray. Okay. I'm going to ask Ms. Goodman if she wouldn't mind doing the prayer for us ending. You're on mute, Ms. Goodman. You hear me now? Yes. yes uh, well, this is what I would like to say to the group. I enjoyed the program this morning, and I'd like to have you all to have peace and joy. And this is the card, if you didn't receive a card from me, to you and yours during the holiday season, and always have peace and joy. 
Let us pray. Dear Father in heaven, I thank you for blessing us this morning to be with all the family and friends and to enjoy this program, the Angel Tree Program, which is part of our church ministry and that we celebrate every year at this season. Thank you for all that were participating in this program and everybody that put the program to the, together. Bless each home that was represented. Watch over us during this holiday season and keep us in your care. Let us enjoy this season and be with us and let us stay healthy and strong and enjoy this season. Be with us, Lord. I thank you for this day. Watch over us and take care of us and keep us in your prayer. This is my prayer asking your name, Jesus the Christ. Amen. 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 Thank you, everyone. Merry Christmas. Thank you. Merry, Merry Christmas, Christmas, everybody. Hello, Christmas. And God bless you. Each Before and every one of you. Out, I saw Mrs. I saw Dr. Marshall's block light up. Oh, yes. Oh, uh -huh. okay. Would you like to say something, Emily? What did she say? Julia. Julia. Say something. To you. Huh? Say hello to everybody. Hello, Merry yeah. Christmas. Hello. Enjoy the program. It's nice, especially Mark. <laughs> Barbara, Barbara Solo. <laughs> we love that the best. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> I get a I get an A plus for remembering the words. <laughs> well, you know, Barbara, you had help because Alma Goodman was singing along with you. Oh. Yes, he was. <laughs> Absolutely. And also, but, I just wanted to say uh, with the um, with Wyatt uh, Murdoch and uh, Matthew Rosebarrow, oh. all of the youngsters were really wonderful. I, I didn't even recognize them because they've grown. So grown mm -hmm. we are still being blessed by God and we thank mm -hmm. him for it. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Thank That's you, great. creators, Rhonda and Stephanie. You, you just always come up with something different all the time. All the time. So very nice. Very good. Thank you. Very but nice. Thank program. you, Tanya, for making it possible for us. All right, Tanya. Yes, Tanya, thank you. Yeah, kudos to Tanya. Thank you, everybody. Thank you for making that time. time. Row, row. It's a lot it of a time to put program. This stuff together. Yes. Good. Awesome, guys. Love you guys. Thank you. Love you. All right. Bye -bye. Bye -bye. Bye -bye. Today. Is this Christmas. recording? Yes. yes. So I can go back and hear myself sing. <laughs> <laughs> yes, you can. Yes, Barbara, okay. you can. Everybody, <laughs> um, Emily, thank. Would you thank Kamari and uh, his dad? Oh yeah. Um, mm -hmm. Chris. Okay. Chris. Everything is wonderful. It was just great. Thank you. Thank Let's you. visit again soon. Okay. Okay. Merry Christmas, everybody. Bye bye. Bye bye. Bye bye. Bye bye. 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 bye.